Welcome to another Spreadsheeters video guide. You can find written instructions for these steps on the Spreadsheeters website. In this video, we'll see how to save Excel as PDF without cutting off. The PDF format is commonly used when sharing information. In Excel, because of the spreadsheet layout, it is not always possible to figure out how the data is going to fit on a page. So when I'm saving it as a PDF, if the data on the worksheet cannot fit into a page, the data gets split and cut and comes on separate pages. So when saving as a PDF, I'll have the data which should or could appear on a single page cut off and separated into different pages. So before saving it as a PDF, it is better to look at the print preview, which will show you how the page will look like uh, when I either have to print it or save it as a PDF. So in this example, I have some data here. I want to see how it looks like on the page. For that, I go to File and say Print. Now here, this gives me a print preview. Now when I look down, it says there are two pages. When I scroll to the second page, I find that the last two columns have been cut off. Now this is uh, going to result in uh, two pages of data as a PDF, where two columns have been cut out and put on the second page. So that uh, will not help and uh, whereas this is only two columns, it is possible to fit it into a single page. So what uh, I will do is here, I will go to the uh, scaling option here and say fit the sheet on one page. So when that is done, it still looks legible and it is reduced to one page. So the other last two columns have been accommodated. So now that this is done, I can save it as a PDF. So here I'll just go to save as select the PDF option and then I can uh, of course choose the folder where I want the file saved and I can then save the file and this will get saved as a PDF. So this is how to save Excel as PDF without cutting off. Please read the appended article for further guidance.